Hello, we're back. Um, so, I made a little brain fart. I um, actually ended up um, continuing to play without hitting the record button again. So I actually finished up this place, or at least I got the Welkin Stone. But, uh, wow, I've actually run out of hammers. So yeah, I've um, actually got the Welkin Stone. I uh, got told to head back to uh, Martin at Cloud Ruler Temple, which we're going to do right now. And, uh, yeah. I'm sorry you guys didn't get to see that, but just a lot of zombies and uh, the King of Miskarkand, some necromancer guy thingy, came and uh, tried to beat me. But I took them down relatively easy. So, yeah. Uh, nothing special happened. I'm not going to reload and play through half the dungeon again, just for you guys. Because I kind of have an agenda. <coughs> so yeah, let's just uh, head uh, the direction of Cloud Ruler Temple. So... Yeah, scratch my beautiful, beautiful beard here a little bit. Beards are itchy. I'm sure that's something you girls are wondering about. But yeah, beards are in fact itchy. Let's keep heading in this direction. Oh, what's this? Statue of some kind? Looks like the... Uh, Azura or the altar thingy? What the hell is this? Demetrius. Huh. Basil. Mm. Uh, do you wish to make an offering to Altar of Meridia? Uh. Okay. By the detritus of the profane, I am brought forth. And by your offering, you have made the profane your interest model. Hmm. The undead ephemeral, unnatural things. Some of my rivals take pleasure in these abominations. Not Meridia. I wish these creatures destroyed. Hidden behind a oh. door, deep in okay. Ruling Cave, are necromancers. The group grieves for the materials to raise their undead artists. Find these necromancers. Destroy them and their abominations. Do this and earn the gratitude of Melania. Huh. Okay. I guess we have another quest to deal with as well. Hey guy, looked like you were trying to go down on me there. Not sure how I feel about that. Um, 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 um. Now, do we go to the cave thingy and continue that, or do we head back and deliver the quest? Let's go back to Cloud Top. Have I been there? I don't know. We're heading to Cloud Ruler Temple. Let's head there and deliver the Great Welkins down at least. First off. So you guys can at least see that part of the quest. So yeah, I was anyways lost down in those catacombs, or not catacombs, but uh, ruins. And uh, it actually took me like 20 minutes to find a damn thing. Hey guy, you got yourself With some armor. With respect, sire, there must be another way. The risk is too great. I know the risk. I was at Kavach, but there is no other way. We have no choice. The Countess will never agree to it. What do you need, friend? She will. She must. Very well. The blades are, as always, at your disposal. Huh. Ah, here you are. I have good news. The sword. Yes. Let's see what he thinks of your plan. You're back. And you've got the great stone. I do. I had a choice. <laughs> Said I'd get it. Did. I can count on you. Mm -hmm. 
given a great welcome stone. I never thought to see a great welcome stone as beautiful as all the old tales tell. Yeah. But of course its beauty is a mask for its deadly power, like everything crafted by the aliens. Now, we need only one more item, and we'll be ready to open a portal to Manka Cameron realm. Sure we want to do that? I'm not. What is the last item we need? You should have seen it sooner. It's the counterpart to the Great Welkin Stone, just as the first two were the opposed powers of the Daedra and the Divines. Welkin Stones contain the concentrated power of Mundus. Mm -hmm. Their counterparts are Sigil Stones, which are used to hold open Oblivion Gates. Ah. A Great Sigil Stone, then, is what you require. Fantastic. You're not going to like it. <laughs> Joffrey doesn't like it. The Countess of Bruma certainly isn't going to like it. Great sigil stones are the anchors of great gates. The kind of gate the mythic dawn opened at Kavach. Okay. The kind of gate the mythic dawn wants to open here to destroy Bruma. So you mean we're going to allow it? I said you weren't going to like it. <sighs> the risk is great, I know. I was at Kavach. I saw the terrible power of the Daedric siege engine. Hmm. But we have no choice. The only way to recover the Amulet of Kings is to allow the Mythic Dawn to proceed with their plan to attack Bruma. I'm not so sure I'm comfortable with that, but... Uh... No. Huh. I'll lead the defense of Bruma myself. Awesome. A priest. To the Emperor. It's time I started acting like one. I guess. I keep forgetting you're actually the king now. Remember when we first met in Kavach? I told you that I didn't want any part of the God's plan. I still don't know if there is a divine plan, but I've come to realize that it doesn't matter. <laughs> what matters is that we act, that we do what's right when confronted with evil. That's what you did at Kavach. It wasn't the gods that saved us, it was you. Were you acting for the gods? I don't know. Nah. Now, it's my turn to act. I'm not on speaking turn with the gods. Please, my friend. I need your judgment, not your obedience. I explain myself to you so you understand me, and so you can explain to the Countess. Oh. I'm afraid she may take a bit more convincing than you. Damn, so I'm supposed to go convince the damn hag? Good. Okay. Have her meet me in the chapel of Talos for the council of war. That seems a fitting place to make such desperate plans. Sure. You're the one trying to conjure up a great Welkin... No, not Welkin stone. But, uh... Great Oblivion gets. That's gonna be a hoot of a time, I'm sure. Well, let's go try to convince the damn lady. I don't think I've had any interaction with her earlier. Actually, I think I was given a quest to talk to her at some point, but uh, I don't think I did do that. So yeah, let's go have a chat with the lady. It's a pleasure to see you. Hey, Countess Narina Carvine. Greetings. What news from? Cl Battle plans. Desperate plan indeed. This prince? Emperor? Martin would risk my whole city to gain a great sigil stone? Apparently. This is the only way to stop this invasion from oblivion? Apparently. I must confess, you are the first person to speak of victory against these Daedra. This well. war seemed hopeless to me. But what else was there to do but hold on and wait for a hero to arise to save us? Hey, I'm a hero. And now it seems there is an heir to the throne after all, hidden yeah. at Cloud Ruler Temple. And perhaps a hero as well? Yeah, well, you know. You avoid answering my question. Very well. Don't think I doubt you. The rulers of Bruma have long had dealings with Cloud Ruler Temple. We know whom they serve. Mm -hmm. I will meet Martin at the chapel. When all is ready, I will order my men to stop closing the gates and prepare for battle. Hmm. 
Uh, it's going to be a tough one, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it is. Damn, I'm so screwed. Well, okay, so I'm supposed to head off to the uh, chapel. How about mixing up some potions? You look like quite the alchemist. I have a ton of potions. You want to buy some? Uh, not that I actually think you want to buy some, but I actually do have a ton of potions. A lot. A lot of potions. And poison, if that's your fancy. It seems that my uh, magic is not regenerating naturally. It used to regenerate a lot better, I'm sure. Let's see if I have any... yeah, damage magicka. Let's see... disease. Do I have any cure diseases? Astral vapors. What does that do? I assume that has something to do with my magicka regeneration. Green spore? How the hell did I contract that? Anyways, let's see if I have any cure disease potions. Cure poison. Just for good measure. Um, I guess I could try to make some. And the spell, just for good measure. And no, doesn't seem like I have any uh, cure disease. Let's see if I can make any. I think I might have some ingredients that mix. Uh, resist poison, fortify, damage, damage luck, resist poison, no. Need cure disease. Seems I have no ingredients that make a cure disease potion. Potion, I mean, of course. Uh, expert. Let's throw this one away. So I need two. And they actually weigh a lot, so... That looks a bit strange, but... Oh well. Stranger things have happened in this world, I'm sure. Let's recharge this baby. <sighs> now, what am I supposed to be doing? Um, I assume I'm supposed to follow her. I told the Countess blah 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 when I'm ready for battle I should inform the Countess. Okay. Come with me. Okay. Come what? with me to the chapel. Yeah. Let's follow her to the chapel, which is that big building I assume. So before we go uh jumping into any great oblivion gates, I'm Thinking I might want to uh, get some. Uh oh, did that heal me? Uh, yes, it did. Mm, yes, it did. Awesome, cool. Blessings of Stendhal. Dear Bella loves you. Akatosh, Julianos. Uh, Talos. Yeah. He's not on speaking terms with me anymore. Mara still likes me. And Cunareth is still with me. So, you coming? Come on then. Slowpoke. Yeah, apparently that's going to be in my next episode. The whole um, prepping for a huge fight. I think I want to uh, spend a little bit of time getting the uh, lesser uh, sigil stones. Get some more uh, resist magic, uh, magic resistance uh, sigil stones. So yeah. gonna be my next task. I don't know, do you guys want to see that? Or do you, want, do you guys want me to go ahead and do that part without you? Because it's just gonna be boring closing up Oblivion Gates. I will call out my militia if necessary, but must we truly stand alone? I don't think we can survive the Daedric onslaught. Hmm. 
Uh, I will get more allies. Am I supposed to go? Thank you. I know that delay is dangerous, but it is all for naught if we lose the battle before you can recover the great. S very true. Very true. Well, I guess uh, that's it for this episode. Let me know if you want uh, the uh, want to see me closing up Oblivion Gates and gathering more. Uh, Sigil stones with the resist magic so I can jump my items. Prepare for a huge fight. See, this one only has uh, fortify intellect for armor and uh, absorb intelligence for for weapons, so it's not the one I want. Uh, let's hope we get the ones I want when I go closing up more gates. But yeah, let me know if you want uh, want to see it or not. What is this? Oh! Okay, so that's what the Valor Stone does. Well, uh, learned something new today as well. Anyways, I leave you with this beautiful little scenery here. The calm before the storm, so to speak. And uh, yeah, remember to rate, comment, and uh, subscribe. And uh, what else? What else? Yeah, the whole like uh, first thingy. Whoever gets first gets a shout out in my next video. And uh, yeah, awesome. Keep up the good work, guys. Have a good day. And uh, I'll see you when I see you. Bye.